In the beginning of this lab, we are using our understanding of density to make predictions about whether or not an object will float in water. Because density is a characteristic property, we can expect the same materials to behave in exactly the same way, no matter how much of it we have. For example, we know that water has a density of one gram per cubic centimeters. So we expect the wax block, which has a density of 0.92 grams per cubic centimeters, less than that of water, to float. And we can predict that the white plastic block, which has a density of 0.97 grams per cubic centimeters, to also float. The transparent plastic block, on the other hand, has a density greater than 1 gram per cubic centimeters. At 1.15 grams per cubic centimeters, it sinks in water. Let's look at the rest of our objects and observe what happens. Aluminum block, steel screw, copper cylinder, and nylon spacer. They all sink in water because their densities are greater than 1 gram per cubic centimeters.